DNA science is shutting down white supremacist myths. And here's how. White supremacists love to idolize blue eyes and blonde hair, but here's the twist. The gene for blue eyes comes from Western hunter-gatherers who had dark skin and didn't even speak Indo-European languages. And blonde hair? It came from early European farmers who migrated from Anatolia, AKA the Near East. And guess what? They didn't speak Indo-European languages either. Now the people who did spread Indo-European languages, they were mostly dark haired and darker skinned than modern Europeans, with significant admixture from Caucasus hunters and minor Mesopotamian admixture as well. But here's the ultimate irony about staying pure. The earliest Indo-Europeans who migrated and mixed with locals kept their language and identity. Meanwhile, the descendants who stayed behind, like modern Northeast Caucasians, think Khabib, have the most of pre-proto-Indo-European ancestry today but lost the language and identity entirely, adopting local Caucasus culture instead. If you'd like to get a comprehensive historical analysis of your DNA, then click the link in our bio.